Hello guys and girls welcome back to Dusty Rides today we are going to Imagica which is a theme park near Lonavla it is equidistant between Mumbai and Pune if you take Mumbai Pune expressway you can reach there very easily yesterday we had gone to a falls called Kalmandavi waterfalls which is a 24 bar 7 to 365 days waterfalls water is available even on, even in summer it was very beautiful Uh, so click the video about to look at that via waterfalls so if you want to come to imagica on a weekend it's usually very crowded so booking ticket through online is always recommended because you can save some time uh, standing in queues for getting the ticket so that way it will be easier to get in faster than standing in queue you can just uh, show the ticket and uh, uh, get your bands to get in and secondly you can take different tickets for dry rides and water rides so dry rides cost you around 1900 for uh, with including taxes and water rides cost you around 1600 including uh, the taxes and uh, around 900 uh, is for fast track so uh, if you uh, take dry rides and water rides both it comes to around 3400 uh, uh, not including the fast track but uh, i don't think you will be able to cover both uh, dry rides and water rides if you come on weekend because it is so crowded if you come on a weekday though it is possible to cover both uh, so but there is another option called passport which if you take you will be able to do dry rides and water rides and you can come another time in within a year to cover again dry rides and water rides so you get four rides within uh, 3000 which is for which is the uh, cost of passport and you'll be able to cover cover it four times so that seemed like a better option for us so we came here last year and then we have come here again this year so if you are staying in mumbai or pune it might be a better option for you as well so you can come twice in a year and uh, finish off your rides within 3000 rupees So uh first thing that we did after going inside was to go on a roller coaster because this is the longest roller coaster in India. So we wanted to try that. Uh you can take your bags with you uh for roller coaster. So uh there's no need to keep it in locker and um this actually uh, goes for a free fall for around 40 seconds and then takes 3 360 degree uh turns. uh where you go upside down for three times so uh, this was actually a very good ride and everyone was uh, uh very keen to go on this for the first time so we liked it very much now i'm going to show you a video of how the ride was hope you like the roller coaster video so if you are someone who get faint uh, if you are going to go on a roller coaster please don't select uh, the dry rides uh, option at all otherwise it's going to be a waste of money for you so uh, again there was another ride dry ride which we liked so this uh, ride is called a screamer so what it does is this is actually like a pendulum which uh, which uh, goes a uh, on either side to about uh, 100 to 110 degrees so uh, it takes you to that height uh, holds there for a second and then goes back to the other direction 
so this was very good too this was like very thrilling and uh, some of our friends got uh, a bit dizzy after coming back and then we had to rest for some time and then go on next ride and there are a lot of other options for kids as well uh, where uh, the kids lesser than uh, 120 cm can enjoy and uh, there are there were other uh, shows like laser shows and uh, other shows as well uh, there was a bollywood show uh, which you can kind of uh, enjoy within the uh, indoor uh, space rather than standing on the uh, sun and uh, this this was another ride which we enjoyed a lot where we didn't go into the ride at all so we just stood outside uh, uh, so what this is this is like a, a water area where uh, you go on a boat and you can shoot others not with bullets or paint but with water so this seems like a fun if you're going inside but it is actually a very big very big fun if you are standing outside so two of my friends are standing outside and shooting water on others where uh, those people are fighting with each other unfortunately they cannot uh, shoot water at us because their guns range is very small less but we could uh, splash water on them so this was very fun and uh, there were other um, uh, rides such as uh, horror ride uh, which we went in we thought it will be a, a really horror show but it was not uh, uh, so scary uh, probably because it's uh, all the kids and everyone is allowed to the so so it's, it was not that scary but it they had made quite an effort to uh, bring some sort of darkness and uh, gore things into this so after this uh, we were we got enough of this dry rides and uh, wanted to go to water rides so uh, we had we have to go to water rides using a bus and it takes actually 10 minutes from uh, from going to from uh, dry rides to water rides once we got into the water rides the actual fun started so we all enjoyed all the ride all the water rides so there were uh, uh, racer rides where uh, five people go can go at the same time and uh, uh, we can you can see who comes out first so and uh, we had rides where uh, two people can go together three people can go together four can go together the wave pool here was also very clean and it was not as uh, deep as what we saw in wonderla so i uh, even kids could enjoy here and you can see how clear it is with our videos and uh, we, our friends really had a very good time and with all the vibes here <laughs> like uh, how you can see narin here all the water rides were as good as what we saw in wonderla in bangalore in fact some of the water water rides here were even longer than uh, wonderla rides and more thrilling than wonderla but what we saw as difference was that in wonderla uh, the water uh, balloons that we see here on which we ride uh, those were brought in much quicker and there was no wait time for that but uh, in imagica we had to wait a lot for this because we had they had only uh, very few uh, water balloons and we had to wait till it come came so that we could uh, get on a ride sometimes we waited for even 5 minutes to get one and uh, in some places we had to carry a rubber mat uh, on our own uh, and we had to carry it on the steps to go up and then come back with our own mat so those were some uh, small difficulties with this so other than that we enjoyed all the rides i'll show you some of the theme park videos now
Hope you liked this week's video. I will see you with another video next week. Till then, bye bye.